What's up YouTube, this is Blueberry7497 and I have another tech video for you. Um, in this video we're going to be, uh, I will be showing you how to get uh, custom uh, boot logos for your iOS 5.1.1 device. Um, okay, so without further ado, let's get started. Um, you're going to have to be, uh, first, if you're new uh, to jailbreaking or anything, you're going to need to be jailbroken and have Cydia installed. Um, then we're going to go into Cydia, you'll open up Cydia and you will go and uh, type in animate fix and it'll be the first one that pops up uh, I know you can't see it but I will have it in the description don't worry um, and uh, don't be alarmed if you're running iOS 5.1.1 um, even though it says that it won't it, it doesn't show that it'll work it just says 4.x.x or 5.0.x uh, don't worry it will work for 5.1.1 so after you're done typing in you'll see the first selection you go ahead and hit that here's what it will look like and as I said down here in the description, it's not going to say 5.1.1, but it will work. I uh, have tested this. Um, so it says modify for me, but you'll just go ahead and install it. Um, there is no, uh, I, it didn't ask me to respring or reboot, so you may have to do that. Keep that in mind after you install it. Uh, after you install it, then you'll go into settings and you'll have this boot logo right here. Um, you'll go into boot logo. And like I said, you may need a respring uh, in order to get that. If you go in the settings after, right after installing and it's not there, uh, respring or reboot may be necessary. Um, so when you first install it, you'll only get built-in, which is the Apple logo and Chronic Dev. You can go into Cydia and go into uh, sections, add-ons in the boot logo, uh, add-ons, I believe it's what it's called. And you can get more. For example, I have the Absinthe boot logo. We'll just go ahead and test out the Chronic Dev. Um, so without further ado, we'll go ahead and take a look. Now I will reboot it. And there it has switched to the um, Chronic Dev logo, the uh, like a skull. Um, I guess you can say Skullified Apple logo. Um, I noticed that right after it's done flashing that boot image or uh, boot logo image, uh, after a few seconds it's done doing that, it will uh, show this spinning wheel. Um, don't be alarmed. It's not putting it into safe mode or, or any anything like that. I guess that's just the process uh, as it being on iOS 5.1.1. Um, but it should be fine. Um, everything should work just, just fine and I'll... Go ahead and show you slide to unlock here. Um, as you can see, uh, it didn't be it didn't present me with that. Sorry, uh, the springboard has crashed a notification or anything like that. It did start up. Um, so there you have it, boot logos for iOS 5.1.1. And just in case I forgot to show you, here's my about screen to show you 5.1.1 right there. Uh, I know it's kind of hard to see. Um, but it does say 5.1.1, so there you go. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, uh, subscribe up there, and if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, feedback, anything, whatever you want to go ahead and let me know, just do it in the comments right down there. Um, it's greatly appreciated, and I will get back if you need me to. Thanks, and I'll catch you in the next video.